Well, what I really came to inform you about was the registration fees for the students. Ah. Now, it's five pounds per head, and I should be grateful if you would collect the money and bring it to my office in your tea break. Right, I'll do that. Well, we have one thing to be grateful for, anyway. Sex won't be rearing its ugly little head. <laughs> Beg your pardon? Well, in my experience, it isn't race or religion that causes the problems. It's usually the presence of some foreign beauty. Jealousies, intrigues, all that sort of thing. Yes, well, looking at my class, I don't think we'd be too bothered with anything like that. <laughs> I come to learn English. Have I come to the right place? <laughs> Enter. Mrs. Courtney. Miss. Miss. I've just brought the registration fees for the students. Ah, good. Now, how many students have you? Nine. So there should be 45 pounds in there. Yeah, well, that all depends upon the rate of exchange. I don't mind. <laughs> <know. laughs> uh, not all of them had uh, five pounds in English money, so I collected 29 pounds 50 in sterling, and the rest is made up of 2,000 yen, 3,000 lira, <laughs> 250 pesetas, 75 drachma, 50 francs, and 12 Deutschmarks. <laughs> According to this morning's financial papers, that should give us a profit of one pound forty-two and a half p. Then I suggest you take it to the bank in the morning and convert it to English currency. Right, I'll do that. Oh, by the way, how's the femme fatale? Ah, yes, Danielle. Well, at the moment she's in the tea room with Italy, Spain and Greece trying to establish diplomatic relations. <laughs> well, I hope she's not going to cause any bother. Oh, no, I'm sure she won't. Look, I'm not going to sit here. No, it's me who's going to be sitting here. And before you, we'll sit over there. And before you, we'll sit over there. You take it on me. Who, me? You go back, sit where you were before. No, I sit here. You not sit here. Ha! Who's going to be stopping me? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Yourself. You think you're tough? Come out the side. <laughs> okay. <laughs> where are you going? We go outside to have a punch down. You mean a punch down? <laughs> I'm going to, uh, how you say, uh, knock his bloody block off. <laughs> we see who's a bloody blocker is, and knocker it off. <laughs> oh, just a minute. What is all this about? I tell you, Mr. White. Brown. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> it's about where we sit. Well, what's wrong with where you were sitting before? It's uh, my eyes, Professor. I've got to sit near the front. Here. <laughs> Oh, I see, and I suppose it's got nothing to do with the fact that Danielle is sitting here too? She is? <laughs> <laughs> I never noticed! <laughs> you see, so my eyes, I'm a little short-sighted. And also, I'm much a bigger liar. It's not true, Mr. Green. The name is Brown. <laughs> you see, I'm a colorblind, as you are. And, Max, I suppose you've got trouble with your eyes as well, have you? Oh, no, no, no. My eyes are OK. Uh, it's my ears. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not hearing very well. That's a likely story. What you say? <laughs> I say you both go back and sit where you were sitting before. Now. Santa yeah, Maria. Maria. I hope you don't think I was, uh, how you say, too forward. No, no, I'm sure you weren't in any way to blame at all. Teacher, please. Oh. Mr. Blau? Yes? Please forgive my rateness. I apologize, but I lost my way. Not to worry. Uh, what is your name? Chung Suli. Suli? And where are you from? Democratic Republic of China. <laughs> and what is your job? Secretary. Chinese diplomat. Very nice. <laughs> right, where shall we put you? Uh, Taro, how are relations between Japan and China? Depends on a political view point. Japan, light wingo. China, right wingo. I see. Are you right winger or left winger? Right winger. I follow teaching of Chairman Mao. Ah, well, in that case, you better sit next to Jamila, the Indian lady. All right? Thank you. Right. Now we will start by learning a few basic English verbs. And firstly, we will take the verb to be. I am English. You are Chinese. He is Italian. 
She is French. He is barbarian. <laughs> you are asking for a kick up your big brown backside. Now look. <laughs> Pay attention, please. I am. I am. You are. You are. He, she, or it oh, is. He, he, she, or it is. We are. We are. 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 You are. You are. 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 They are. They are. They are. All right. They are. I shall now go round the class and ask you each to give me a sentence using the verb to be. To be. To be. Taro. I am. Ah, so. <laughs> I am very happy to be learning English. <laughs> very good. Good. Giovanni. He is. He is a fool. <laughs> good. But not is a He is a fool. Yes, he is a fool. <laughs> Max. Uh, she is. She is beautiful. She is wonderful. She is... Yes, yes, thank you, Max. <laughs> Juan, it is. Por favor. It is. Por favor. It is raining. Lloviendo. It is raining. Ah, no, you It's raining. No, it's raining. It's raining. It's raining. We'll skip you for the moment. Por favor. Uh, doesn't matter. Sit down. <laughs> Suli, it is. It is duty of every citizen to overthrow imperial government. So say Chairman Mao. <laughs> yes, well, that's his opinion. Oh, good. Danielle, we are. Mm. Uh, mm. We are lucky to have such great oh. <laughs> <laughs> But quiet, please. Very true. I mean, uh, <laughs> Ali, you are. You are. You are waiting for me to speak an answer. <laughs> Well done. Um, unfortunately, I'm not understanding the question. <laughs> I want you to give me a sentence using you are. I am. No, not I am. You are. For example, you are from Pakistan. I am from Pakistan. Good, yes, but now use you are. But I cannot say you are from Pakistan because you are not, are you? <laughs> Repeat after me. You are English. No, no, I am from Pakistan. <laughs> what am I? You are confusing me. <laughs> you are stupid poof. <laughs> Don't you call me poof? Poof. I'm a Sit down. Sit down, please. Right. <laughs> I was telling you about what I would like you to do is some homework, all right? I want you to write me an essay. A short story about your life here in England. The things you do, the things you like. And I'll see you all on Wednesday.